Hello, and welcome back to Amonkhet Sealed Friendly League. Just trying to get a feel for the format. Got nine rounds. We're six in. We're five and one. This is our deck. It is a green-blue monstrosity. It's got some tempo plays. It's fun. Let's, let's see. We are not going to add packs. We're going to keep it the 70 play points we got. Play points are important. Need those for uh, constructed leagues, etc., etc. So you can draft more. Hmm. I'm still not sure whether Ronus' Monument is good because it is either. Um, Every time I've drawn it, it's either been like pushing for pushing through several damage in a game in a way that like a creature just like wouldn't be able to do. It's a pretty good hand. Yeah. And other times it's just dead. There's no middle ground. It's always just like either insane or sort of nothing. Um We'll probably cycle with Drake. We have a lot of two drops, but uh, hmm, yeah. Hope we get a two drop next turn. Blue white, blue white's good. The card's good. We've come up a lot on the two mana exerters. Ah oh, no! All right. Well, we'll definitely wait to cycle. Let's see if he plays a three drop. Okay. Three colors. Okay. That's fine. Hmm. I'm going to play the Naga just for mana efficiency. If he plays Essence Scattering, it would be sad. Or Sensor. Ooh, haven't played against that card yet. Oh, Flash Cat. That's a question. Do I just block that? Not anymore, I don't. <laughs> nope. Definitely don't. Okay. This is interesting. He isn't. Okay, he is. Is he going to make certain? No, of course not. Okay. Huh, I think we're going to take six here. Interestingly. Um, yeah, I'm not trading my three for your two. Okay. This is a this cartouche is actually like a pretty good pretty good tempo. I, the white one is the one I was most skeptical about. Oh come on. Three colors and this guy is just like totally cool. Never having problems. Man. Uh, really behind on board now. Hmm. Can't really play this. That's not a good play. I can play Skirmisher and hold up S and Scatter and make sure he doesn't just run me over. Skirmisher can block things. I could do nothing and just spidery grasp is 4-3 as if that weren't obvious. He's not going to trade this. Like He's just going to race me. I'm going to play this. I should have traded Watchful Naga for this. That's why I don't really like this card as much. He was really good in the early few matches. He drew me like two or three cards, but when I'm playing against decks that are Doing this, he just does nothing. Yeah, exerted. Yeah, okay. I will just trade with this and um, take some damage. It's gonna be fine. I'm considering cycling Shimmer Scale Drake. Probably not, because I like if I get a land, I'm playing this. This is just a free roll. Uh, yeah. 
I'm gonna bounce that, not feel bad. I could just cycle this. This is not gonna be good. If he doesn't. Well, if he casts a creature, I'm definitely spider or uh, essence scattering it. If he doesn't do anything, I think I'm gonna cycle this. Okay. Yeah, that's worth it. That guy's really good aggressively. Uh, I could just jump this. I think I might have to. Because, like, I definitely. Hmm. All right, this is gonna be unblockable. Ugh, that's so good. Yeah. Yeah, we're getting we're getting beat up. Ugh, man, it just keeps playing things. Yeah, there's not really a good. Uh, yeah, it's just game. Man, we gotta run over that game. That's what our deck's supposed to do. Just run them over. Hmm. <coughs> I think being on the play is gonna be much better. He does have that 7 drop. Hopefully he stumbles on mana a little bit. And we can uh, exploit that. I think I am going to keep this. I'm going to turn one cycle uh, River Serpent. Turn two cycle Drake. So I'm going to get three draws before I start getting punished for not having a forest. I think this is fine. We just get to start the game right on time. What's great is, uh, yeah, okay. No, that's not gonna be good. All right. Um, <laughs> fun interaction with the the during damage step while this guy is. Trigger resolves, I can tap mana. Well, before it resolves, I can tap mana, untap the thing, cast my four drop. Can't do that with four mana creatures, though, so it's kind of bad. I think I'm willing to just trade here. This card's not especially good. I'm going to hit him for three and then just trade when he attacks with that thing. So I think he should just trade here. Now we got a big guy. <sighs> Great thing about this guy and the cartouche is you can just exert him to be way bigger than everything on the board during turn three or so. So if this is um, the cheetah, I think that's fine. I'm going to exert this though, just in case of the cheetah. I'm going to play as if he has that 3 2. Because if he just has nothing, then he's wasted his turn. Yeah, that's fine. I'm going to draw two cards with this. It's going to feel much, much better. Man, again. Yeah. Yeah, maybe the cat's okay. God damn it. I hate coming around on cards that I just don't like. Yeah, Drake's pretty good. Did I forget to cast high? Ugh. 
I probably deserve to lose this game for that. That was really fucked up. <laughs> I'm pretty tilted about that. This is why you don't play it at 12.30 at night. Man. Okay, well... I think he's got like another cat. Like what? I'm not gonna exert this time. If he has the cat and then I trade with it, then that's fine. I think he has like a. Sp no, he wouldn't have used spider and grass, but anyway. I don't know. I'm gonna fight this and hope he's like off on colors or something weird. Like maybe he just has some blue cards. I mean, that seems plausible. Man. Well. Okay. That's super good. He's going to name the Drake. Oh, that's so good. I can just cycle this one, but that's still really good. Oh, God. So good. I'm just disgusted by that. Well, I have a 4 5. That's pretty good. Can't cast it. It says I can cast it, but I can't cast it. I'm just gonna cycle it. Uh, do I want to cast higher look of illumination or cycle this to first? I don't know. It's definitely staying back to block. We'll just swing with both of these. Oh, I mull this over. I definitely want to do one of them. I don't know. Let's cycle this guy. No, oh, I can still select it. That's why. It's because he gets cycling. All right. Well, we'll just hold this one up because we're not going to cast anything for the rest of the turn anyway. Maybe he just got flooded. Yeah. Didn't even matter. What the heck? Seal does such a crapshoot sometimes. The fact that he has those curved two shoes. Again, it makes me want to bring in this Windsor Rebuke. Maybe this is just a good card. He's sort of an aggressive deck. Again, like Trial of Knowledge just makes me uncomfortable. I don't want to tap out on, on any turn to do that. Maybe I should have Gale Strike instead, but I think Windsor Rebuke is going to be good. This is definitely a good hand. Yep. There's your Evolving Wilds. Yeah, maybe he's just a like a more blue deck. Ugh, man. These are kind of low impact now. We kind of want lands. We can play these cards, but... Oh, yeah. That's what I like to see. Um, I think this guy's just stone better. Is this a common? It's an uncommon. Have to say, cycle guy. Okay. Sure. Yes. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Play this guy. It's pretty aggressive. It's possible that I should have um, played Kudu. Just to make it a 3-4? I don't know. This guy exerts. And then just so that next turn if I get a land quarry hauler is great. Yeah. See, that was kind of a mistake. Okay. I can cast Tycrop. 
plus something. I'm gonna exert this brawler, and if he does some trick shit, we can win some rebuke. And it'll be really good. Or I can spidery grasp. It's exerted. Yeah. Okay. Is he gonna double block? Oh, I just get blown out, dude. I want to die first. Do I want to bounce something? Or do I want to just spider grasp it? I think I want to spider grasp it because I exerted this. Oh no, I want to play top crop scare skirmisher. I want to add to the board. So I think I'm going to bounce the Great Maw because that seems kind of like. Yeah, we're going to bounce the Great Maw because that seems like something that's going to be. Oh, uh, it might be better. I don't know. I, I don't. I don't want him to hold up another pouncing cheat. Card's annoying. Yeah. Now we can play. It should have been pouncing cheetah because these both trade with pouncing cheetah. Yeah. Yep. I'm making play mistakes all over this this game. I'm just gonna attack into it with both of them. Yep. If I spider egg rasp to kill that thing, then I'm definitely feeling pretty good about it. Oh no! I'm a moron! Oh! Oh god! Oh! Alright. I don't even want to post this video anymore. I'm pissed. Alright. Whatever. Jesus. So sad. Such a sad, sad day. Maybe he plays the hippo and just puts things on this guy. That'd be cool. That's how we're winning this game, damn it. Yep. Jesus. I don't deserve to win this game either. Because of that. Oh, he is just doing that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. It's a good one. And I really want to use that card now. This is just gonna be a chump blocker. I'm gonna attack with Hooded Brawler and um Yeah, I'm gonna exert it. Yeah. No, he did it. Okay. Then it's good. It's just fine. Because now it's a seven eight. Now it kills your guy. Kill your damn hippo. That's good. Floodwaters. I'm not gonna bounce that. All right. Quarry Hauler makes this into an O1. I like to see that. This is exerted and going to attack next turn. That's pretty good. Yeah. Sure. I'm definitely willing to bounce a creature plus this warrior. Mm. Mm. I'm going to exert this again. And I'm going to attack with both of these, I think. I want to put some pressure on this guy. I want to play camel and make this smaller, but... Oh, we got a cat. That's cool. He likes the cat. 
Okay. Maybe you should trust this guy and play the cat more. Okay. Sure, I think that's good. Yeah, I'd definitely make that smaller. He's got two cards left. Yeah. He basically has no board. He's got a 2 2. I'm not going to block this. Oh, he can't play that, so he had to cycle it. Wow. I wouldn't play double white cards in my three color deck. You can play this guy. Well, okay, never mind. You can play both of these just because they suck. That's fair. He's clearly, like, getting screwed, though. Yeah, sure. It's interesting. Well, finally got this. One end. He's gonna jump that, that's fine. Sure, I'll just have a two, three, I guess. Why don't you just get this guy back? Until I have something better to put this on. This is more mana efficient. Neither one really affects the board more than the other. I would be more willing to just throw this guy under the two. T oh, it's not going to. Well, that guy's very good. Hmm. Yeah, and then this is this is the other reason I didn't get to. Um. Okay, you can do this. It'll definitely be on this guy, unfortunately. This is a 6 7. I throw some guys under it and not feel bad. I think my crackback's a little more. I have floodwaters to switch some math in my favor. Commit is going to be really good. And this guy is super good. It's just a giant crocodile, man. Man. It doesn't show the embalmed token versions. That's messed up. You gotta see the mummy nagas to beat the mummies are cool. <sighs> That's interesting. Yeah, he's just gonna I mean, I'll trade with that at this point. Yeah. Okay, this gives him double. And it speeds up his, like. <sighs> so late. So late. Um, I hate cycling floodwaters in this situation, but it doesn't look too good. I don't know, I might do it. I can't really attack. It's sort of annoying. <laughs> Sure. <sighs> That's a pretty good 
course. Six, seven, it would... Yeah, these two would trade with this still. I think I'm okay with that. I'm gonna block this. I'm gonna cycle this floodwaters. It's definitely bad against his stuff. He's embalming that. Uh, well, maybe it's. I can just commit that though. Yeah, I'm just gonna commit that. Feels kind of bad, but yeah. yeah. This guy's good because he assists with the killing of this giant thing, and Bitterblade Warrior is good because it attacks through it. So I think that's good. Now we have this Essence Scatter for whatever he has. Oh, uh, absolutely not. No. I guess we're casting this next turn to shuffle away his graveyard. Extremely awkward plays. Jeez. I mean, yeah. Whatever. Ah, uh, yeah, see, these are all good, though. So. I've casted that card so many times. He's probably just going to trade this. Because <laughs> he's got so many cards in his hand. And he's going to be like, oh, this, I don't even need this anymore. God, his deck's pretty good, too. Yeah, okay. Alright. And, hmm. These are all cards I feel like I've played this game, too. Moto Shuffler, etc., etc. <sighs> Shit! Oh, no! Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, man. Just beat me down. Okay, well, this guy's definitely not good. Yeah. It's a 7 8 first strike. Man. that guy and attack. Play like Kudu. Yeah. I'm not going to exert because I want to be able to attack next turn with it. So 
there a two mana untap your creature thing? He could have that rare one. That would blow me out. Oh no, he had that. This might lose me the game. Uh, I guess that's not bad. Uh, Jesus. Oh, crap. It's basically a two for one. Can never get rid of that thing. He's got six cards. Do I just want to throw this away there? Jesus. That's a very good one. I believe I lose this one. I didn't realize realize he had this one up. I thought you said the two mana. Uh okay. This cannot die in combat like ever. Alright, we'll play this guy and he's gonna target himself. I guess. And he's just gonna get thrown under the bus. Yeah. This, man. That's why I don't play it in the middle of the night, dude. It's almost one in the morning. Just gonna block it next turn, you know. It's got seven cards in hand, they're probably all really good. Tried to get rid of it. Yeah, wow. Okay. Okie dokie, sure. Yeah. You play the Naga. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Nope. Uh, I have 10 mana. this. I think I just make this guy really big. Yeah. Yeah. That's the thing, like... Hmm. Whatever. The only way to get rid of the um, the angel is really with this spidery grasp. Yeah. Let me try and race our opponent for what that's worth. I kind of just need to draw a creature, though. Yep. Yep. Okay. 
God. Really? Bitter blade warrior. Man. Do some chumping with that guy. Hmm. Really wish I had a creature now. <sighs> I'm just gonna jump with that guy. Um Yeah, we'll try and trick our opponent here. Bit of spidery grass for what that's worth. What? Okay. Okay. Sure. All right. Just fog my guy. Turn. That's cool. Okay. Uh, I'm always afraid of yielding through this step. Okay, yeah, we're gonna kill Angel. We're gonna cast Spidery Grass. We're gonna bounce Watchful Naga. Yeah. I'm gonna chump with the bitter blade warrior. Get my Drake back. What does that do? Cycling. Okay. Yep. It's definitely just gonna bring this guy back and get rid of this. Six mana. It's most of his turn. It's funny, this just is 4 mana removal for my 2 2. Mm. It's kind of weird. I don't even feel that bad about this game. Like, it's gonna get this. Yeah. He still has a lot of mana, actually. He's got 4. Yeah. There's floodwaters when you need it, right? Yeah. He had more action after the uh, commit to memory thing. He just drew more than I did. Which is sort of the risk of that card, that's why it's not. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, this is looking. Bad. Can't read. Does floodwaters kill him? No. Does he just attack with everything and kill me? No. I mean, I don't think I win this, but. Oh, he just exerts this and kills me, though. Yeah. I'm dead. Yeah, I just threw a lot more lands than this last time. Oh, he just didn't. In case I have something, I guess. Is there a creature that draws me a card? Don't think so. 
there is a card that draws me two cards. Um, even that wouldn't kill him. Yeah, even this does nothing. I can't do this. Yep, there we go. Second loss. That's fine. Yeah, opponent's deck was really good. Had a lot of really, really good cards. Yeah, maybe we should get it back. Psych, not doing it. See you next time.